Hey everyone, my name is Olaf, and in this tutorial I'll show you the quickest ways to add holes in Blender. As always, it's going to be quick and easy, so uh, let's get started. Okay, so press X to delete the default cube, and let's add a monkey, so press Shift A and add a monkey. Then press Ctrl 5 to add 5 subdivisions, and then S to scale. And now we need to install some add-ons so that we can add the holes. So go into Edit, Preferences, and then the first one will be the uh, Pool tool. So enable the Pool tool. And then next, we also need to enable another add-on, which we'll use later in the tutorial, which is a uh, different way to add holes, which is the uh, Carver add-on. And then let's go back into the viewport. And we're going to start off with the Pool tool, which you can find by pressing N. And um, then we can add an object, which will uh, create the hole. So uh, let's add some additional vertices for the cylinder. And then press R, X, then 90. And then press S to scale. And then press S, then Y to scale it on the Y axis. And now we're going to make a hole through the head of the monkey. So press G, then set to grab it on the Z axis and then Shift D, then Set to duplicate it, and we'll use this one later. And then select the uh, cylinder, then the monkey, and then the first way is to uh, select the Auto Boolean, and then Difference. As you can see, we get a uh, quick hole through the head of the monkey. The next way is to use the uh, Brush Boolean. So press G, then Set, to grab it on the Z axis, and then hold in shift and select the monkey. And then select difference under brush boolean. And when we select the uh, object, you can now see that we can move the hole. And then press S to scale if you want to scale down the hole. And then you can apply the brush and then delete the uh, brush. Okay. And we can also press shift A and uh, add a star, for example, which you can get in the Extra Objects add-on. So that way you can add a little bit more complex holes. Then press G, then Set to grab it on the Z axis, then RX, then 90, and then press S, then Y, then press S to scale it down, and then we can grab it on the Z axis, and hold in Shift and select the monkey, and then brush boolean, and then we can select the brush and move the star hole around the monkey object. Okay, so now you know how to use the bool tool in Blender, and the next step of the tutorial will be on how to use the Carver add-on, which is also a very useful way to add holes in Blender. Okay, so select the monkey, then press numpad 1, then numpad 5. So press Control shift x for the Carver tool. And then you can click on the left mouse button to add a rectangular hole. And then press space to cut the hole. You can also press space to change the type of cut. So let's do a circle cut, for example. And then space to confirm. You can also use the line cut type, so just the left mouse button click and then press space to confirm. As you can see, we get a cut here as well. And we can also press H for help. And then if we press B, you can see that we have the profile brush with a lot of different uh, types of uh, cuts. So uh, press X to change the type, then press S to scale, and then you can press D to change the thickness, and then you press space to add the hole. And this is what it looks like. And you can add a lot of different holes using the uh, profile brushes. And uh, that's it for this tutorial. Thank you guys for watching and subscribe. 
and thanks to my patrons as well, Mr. Monkey Shoes and Terry Davis.